so much for joining us again, coming back and watching all the other videos that we have. This is Moments with Mansu, where I sit down with some of your faves and get to know them better. Some of the people I have met and some I haven't met, as you've seen. But today's guest is someone that I've met that I love so much. Hey, my lads. Acting royalty. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. Wait, when yourself? I'm great. Thank you for coming so far. Mm, mm. It's been forever. It's very far. <laughs> I drove for an hour. <laughs> It's just to come and have a moment with man. Oh, thank you so much for coming. Well, Manaka, I think everyone knows your family because you, you know, there's a whole reality show on your lives. But paint a picture of me of growing up in a house with siblings and parents that are so in love and just in a home that's that more. Um, well, it's been quite uh, amazing um, because I, I cannot. Look, um, we've never traveled as a family like outside the country. Really? You know. Well, they did. I wasn't part of it. Oh, okay. Yeah, but um, you know, we're not a family of vacation. Mm. But um, moments with us felt like a vacation. You know. Mm. So we've um, uh, my mom and dad were not shy um of you know taking us you know places within the country. Mm. You know, they were not shy of um you know taking us to. You know, amusement parks mm -hmm. and stuff. But know, that's so. the story of a lot of black families. Yeah, yeah. How many of us can take trouble? Yeah, you know, yeah, exactly. With our families, with our families yeah. I mean, be, just being with our families feels like a vacation, yeah. you know. So, um, not to say we don't. Yeah, I mean, hey. <laughs> <laughs> but um, uh, I was brought up by realists, you know what I mean? I think that influenced um, a lot of my realism, you know what I mean? So, um, uh, there's nothing they hid from us. We were never told that babies come from airplanes mm. and stuff like that, you know. So yeah, I was very. It's it's, it's a very colorful um uh, family. Nearly said full. <laughs> and nearly a very colorful um yeah fam um, family and uh, also um how supportive uh, we are towards each other, mm -hmm. you know. So that is also a nice plus, you know. So do you know when you was growing up and and uh, I mean my siblings were born. Not much later than me, but I grew up around my cousins, mm -hmm. right? And who love off like my grands. You always have a friend within your siblings. Yes, cousins. no, definitely. Who was your bestie growing up? Um, because of the firstborn, you know. So um, I I had a moment with Mbomi, mm -hmm. you know. We were like twins, mm -hmm. and then Dineo came through, and yes, this yellow bone. I don't know if I never looked at my stick, <laughs> but I'm missing this yellow bone and cute little thing, mm -hmm. and you know. Papillion of note, mm -hmm. and um, Janelle and I became close, and Z came along, you know, mm -hmm. 10 years later, and we, we became so. Mm -hmm. I'm literally friends with all my siblings, you know. Mm -hmm. um, right now, just minus one because we have one, mm -hmm. but um, you know, it happens in, in most families, in every family, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, I've, I've been very friendly with uh, most of my siblings because. I was from, you know, uh, uh, a very young age, I think, as yes, soon as Mbomi came through, I mean, wasn't still the best born. Best born. Hey, I best know, it's the best born. Right now, I want to say which one, one of you guys, yeah. yo. Yeah, I'm gonna have. What's going on? You know, but I mean, yeah, we became parents very early. Yeah. Yeah, before we had kids. And, and, the journey of because you've been in the industry for a long time um i remember oh my gosh my, my niece was actually saying i'm like oh i'm gonna have my as a guest she was like and i'm stuck failing <laughs> yeah. but i was shocked that she knew yeah, it because yeah. she's young you yeah. saw her she's young like really sure <laughs> but yes i was like oh my yeah. gosh how do you because yeah. you're so little but that's how a lot of us would remember you but even mm. before stop film some of the shows that you've worked on how has your journey been so um, I mean, the start was very, very rocky, mm. uh, and um, coming back was even rockier because you know there's moments where you feel like, oh my gosh, they feel like I don't belong, mm. you know. So, um, so I had to fight extra hard, you know. So, um, and also not being educated in that sense where I have a degree, you know. Mm -hmm. um, and you mean specifically with film and television, or just generally, okay? <laughs> yeah, with anything. So. So I had to like, you know, literally fight extra hard because I learned on the job, you know. So um, not having that degree means that I have um, many years of working experience. So, I mean, for me, it counts as... as Wait, how, how young were you when you started? Uh, I was literally younger than 10 years old when I, when I started. Mm. Yeah. 
And it wasn't anything that like literally put me out there like you, your um, kiddies TV shows mm -hmm. and stuff or your drama series. I did that much later on, you know. So um, uh, I know the stage. Uh, well, there was a time where I, where I knew the stage more than, you know, I knew cameras and stuff. Yeah, so. So you have been working since you were younger than 10? It's not really counted because at the time, yeah, I was a seven one. <laughs> yeah, right. So I, I, I would start naturally from 1999 when I was done with school. And, yes. you know, the acting bug bit me um, again. So, yeah, I've been around and I know, I've, you know, there's a lot of people um, that we don't see on the screen anymore that I grew up mm. watching and seeing, you know what I mean? And yeah. Do you remember oh, working with people that you, you were like, oh my gosh, um, was it my idol? Yes, a lot, you know. Um, you know, I, I would have to name Bomam Tembi, Jadi Jones, you know, Bo, um, Papa Joe Mafela, mm -hmm. you know. Um, I think I was blessed to have worked with the entire cast of School is Nice, mm -hmm. you know. Wow. Before, um, well, after School is Nice, you know, so they, they came and they featured you know, um, unstuck ball, you know, they played, you know, jammy roles and stuff, you know, so just before they exited, you know, I got a chance to work with them and, you know, um, pick their brains a bit. Yeah. Talk to me about stock because that was yeah. some crazy. Yeah. Thing. And I don't think we've seen you on a sitcom since. No, no, no. And I would love to do a sitcom. You're so funny. Yeah, that's my, like, my strongest point is a sitcom. Yeah. Uh, how was it like working? Because that, also that cast, you know the shows that you watch and you're like, shame they work well together. Mm, mm. But the shows that you watch and you're like, yeah, these ones. We need many seasons of this thing. Yeah. Because yeah. put it in our veins. And we delivered. You know? It was amazing. Yeah. How was that experience? Um, stuff was the uh, first time I literally played first lead. Um, I got a taste of um, how much hard work it is to play first lead. Number so, one. Yeah, it was it was a lot. So I never really got to enjoy Cape Town. I mean, it was shot in Cape Town. Um, most of our cameos, you know, were tethered from Cape Town, you know, so, um, although it was based in, 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 in Deep Blue so we tried by all means to try and keep it like very authentic, you know, so, um, it was a, it was a beautiful journey, you know, um, uh, having to work with that cast, you know, the ensemble was so sure. phenomenal, you know, it was, you know, it, it, like, I don't know. It's as if we had known each other for a long time. Yes. Like, and some of us only met on the show, you know. Um, it was such an awesome thing to work with James because he's, um, you know, um, a theatre guru. Yes. And um, James doing Mojo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and um, his level of comedy sure. is literally out of this world, you know. And then we had um, one of my favourites on the show was um, Chamano. Who played Lisa, you know. Mm -hmm. Um I don't normally have favorites on, on, on shows that I work on. Mm -hmm. But I I gotta take my hat off to that man. Mm -hmm. Like <laughs> like we would literally laugh on set. Like we would pops and have to do so many takes because of how funny he was. It makes you get back on a sitcom. I, 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 really do. Do. I really do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's time now. <laughs> <laughs> Write something. Like you you know what I mean? Ish, writing gives me hot bed, but I'll try. <laughs> I'll try. Maybe even um, Stockfall Reloaded would be You know better. what I mean? Yes. Or take Stockfall on the road and small mm. theaters around the country. Yeah. I don't know. It was quite nice, actually. Yeah, it was, it was, it was an eye opener. I can imagine. Now, uh, I, I imagine with, with a big role and playing first lead or lead for the first time at such a big lead, which is number mm. one. There's a lot of challenges that come big with that. Uh, on set and off set. Yeah, big time. Um, there's a lot of challenges that come with joining a big production like A Generations The Legacy. Mm -hmm. And as viewers, what we see is the amount of fun that you guys are having. Um, the perks and what comes with uh, being in these spaces. But what have been some of your challenges with just choosing this career that have made you also sometimes feel like... No, no, you know, you're... Wise. Yeah. Um... I think because, you know, um, I take challenges head on, you know, um, I don't really get to feel them, you know, um, especially in moments of being unemployed. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not from a rich family. Mm -hmm. I'm not good at saving, you know, <laughs> <laughs> so it's very hard in this day and age. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not good at saving, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so triggered. 
I'm so sure you're you'll, you'll say, 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 but then comes a dry moment and then you have to just... Can I tell you, I do so well for like eight months yeah, and then yeah. one month comes. <laughs> ah, and you but do like, all over and all. Yeah, you know, so, I mean, we'll just stick to it. It's a bit hard. Yeah. These, these days and ages, you know. So, um, uh, uh, the challenges, you know, um, are, are mainly industry. Yeah. You know, where um, you can still feel mm. that... Um, males although you're playing first lead mm. you know are you know still that yeah. you know emulate more and 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 you know um but if i have never seen your contract um it doesn't bother me Easy. you know what i mean so let's just work you yeah. know i'll get to where i need to get to yeah at some point but as long as i just keep on working you know in fact you're gonna wreck your brain if you're still thinking i wonder how much this person is ah uh, no you, i don't have time i just assume we're all gonna yeah. be the same yeah. yeah yeah you know so um in some instances it's pretty obvious you know so it, you can't even mm -hmm. like, like ignore it and um whatever mechanism that i use it's like i'm mm -hmm. so you know mm -hmm. um you just keep it moving um, other challenges you know uh would you know be in a, in a negotiation time is a is a very dreadful time you know i don't even know why they call it negotiations but there's no negotiating you room to negotiate no you know so um these are the challenges that you know we're met up because i think a lot um i know that um the youth is fixing and you know will be okay i have no fear you know for um uh, up and coming artists mm -hmm. uh um because you know we've tried as well you know to try and you know corner this here and there mm -hmm. or fix this there and there you know so we can't fix everything so each generation every generation has its have turn. to yeah to fix something you know um or another so yeah man a challenge in july says nyata is to the month of my mind negotiation they're terrible <laughs> Uh, before all of these were happening, there was obviously young man at growing up, right? Older sister or not? I don't know, dreams. What What did you watch? What do you remember about young man at growing up? Um, I really want. I you know I've always wanted to be in entertainment. I didn't think that I'd get to this side of yeah. entertainment, you know. So, um, events were 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 you know as a business were a thing that I thought I would end up um, at. And I remember when teachers would ask us what do you want to be when you grow up i'd always say i want to be a businesswoman i don't care what business it is <laughs> but i'm gonna business myself yeah. business, you know so um yeah yeah um and it's still the business of you now yeah, yeah yeah you know and i still want to pursue those dreams you know mm -hmm. because um i don't want to get to heaven one day and say oh i should have mm -hmm. oh why didn't i you mm -hmm. know what i mean so yeah i mean uh, there's things that don't mind why didn't i you know so but that yeah you know, I always say to my friend, uh, I, I was like, we, we have multiple talents and multiple interests and passions. And I think we do get stuck in the one thing that works out first. Right? Yes. I mean, you you look at the other things. Oh, yes. yes. That are, I don't think God makes us in yet. No. But other things that yes. you're very good at. And one of you is it. Yeah, yeah. Yes. And I was saying to my friend, 2023 is the year that I'm going to try all those things. Yeah. I, I feel like I'm very good at one, two, three. Yeah. I'm just going to give it a shot. And if it doesn't work, I would have tried it because yeah. I have a case of. I should have done it. Like when I go to bed, I'm like, what am I doing about this thing? Yes. I'm really good at it. Yeah. But do you have things that I, you are like, when you're like, oh my. I have those moments a lot. Shabbat uh, mm. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, uh, besides just, you know, being in the um, a business of events, mm. uh, there's other things that I wanted to, you know, try out mm. and stuff, you know, and to, you know. So, yeah, they give us sleepless nights, those mm. things, you know, that's why we, but like before we die, we have to like you know at least mm. you know have tried half of those things. You know what I mean? If you fail, you fail. You know. See life. Act as a go and act as a go in. And it is my life. You win it is the yeah. 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 Winning it being a mom. Well, that part I am not gonna <laughs> wait for anyone to give me a cut to the back or a hide my whatever. I'm winning there. Dude, badass. My man, like, and I hate the little lad, innit? Yo. So where we find the joy and happiness next? Where we find the joy and happiness to continue and try be our best? I don't know where, mm. but I guess because we're women, you know, um, it just comes naturally. But um, yeah, no, 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 I'm badass there. No. How's the journey been of growing with your daughter? Because I always say mm. my mom and me are twenty two, mm. and I'm always like, I wonder what it's like to be a young mom, right? Mm. Like. Grow you because you're growing yourself. I feel like a 22 year old child. Yeah, you're growing, but you're raising a human being. How yeah. was that 
experience for you? Um, you know, it came with its own challenges, mm. you know, um, and uh, that's when I really felt like, yeah, this is now adulting, mm. you know, because there are certain things that I could um, stomach that I couldn't anymore, mm. you know, because now she's here and now we have to, you know, survive this thing, mm. you know, with or without certain people, mm. you know. So um, it's been a quite it, like it's been quite an inter inter an interesting journey to Mother KG because mothering Lele and Sponsel is very different. Mm. <laughs> so I call her my baby sister. Mm. <laughs> and, oh, it's yeah, you know, and um, sometimes she likes it, sometimes she don't. <laughs> because she's she's your, a baby. Yeah, she mm. feels also being a, a younger sister will be like you know missing out on other mm. perks of mm. being the child. <laughs> but um, yeah, man. Um, uh, I wouldn't uh, turn back the clock. Mm. I really, I don't regret anything, and I think so far so good. Although she made me a grandmother when I didn't want to. <laughs> <laughs> you made that very clear, very clear. But I'm doing great as a granny. <laughs> How is that? That is so funny. I'm going to always want to do you know what? I don't regret anything. I know. Who could have done this to me? Hey, But it's a. Uh, it's a challenge of its own because, hey, you call hey. It's not me that's old. I think it's me that's older than my mom. It's like, it's like this lady birth to my mom. Yeah. She's not my grand, she's my mom's mom. You know? So that boy just keeps us very busy, man. No, no, no. Um, he's very active. In the home, he's somebody test. Say, say. Double check. Because my son is so chill, man. You know? Like, Sponsini is so chill. Like, but you're not going to see his right? So they call them a malumino uh, china in the wood, and um, uh, so cute. you can tell that Bonsengi has assumed the apple <laughs> <laughs> at just two years old. <laughs> I came out of. I just want to explain this to my niece. Lita, Lita is nine, right? Yeah. And she has an aunt who is nine as well. Mm. How old is Tiamo? She's a, she's younger than you. Yeah. She oh, I yeah. <laughs> she was she situation. She says to me, so please explain out to you, I was my aunt. I was like, yo, yeah. Thank you. You understand when you're older. So it's the same situation. Yeah. I've always find those so fascinating. Yeah, very much so, you know. So if I had any plans of having any other kids, I'm, I must just, you know, kill those people. <laughs> <laughs> other kids. Yeah, the other kids now are having other kids, you see. You drunk with that. Hey, I don't think I like that song. <laughs> I'm single, but not single, single. Okay, no, I like that song more. You know what I mean? Um, I am playing with someone. Okay. Uh, that's it, Lisa. Uh, no. Because <laughs> also that's me. Yeah, you know. Um, but uh, I don't think that I'm... I could never say I'm never ready, because I'm always ready for love. Yeah. Always, always. But right now, I'm at a stage where I just want to be me. Why? You know what I mean? Um, because... Because I've seen you in a very committed relationship. Yeah. Like, and why don't you want that? Good. I, I really, I give it my all, eh? Mm -hmm. You do. And these MFs mm -hmm. are not ready for that. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, I was that in, eh? Like, you know, with other kids. Mm -hmm. you know? Let's be in the same game. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So, um, right now, like... <sighs> Growing up, I've never seen myself in, you know, a tutu dress or whatever you guys call those things, those ball gown dresses, dresses, and gay, walk I down. I've never had, I, I don't know, I've always said, you're lying, because, you know, not all of us dream of that, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I've never seen it in my dreams, you know, um, mm -hmm. you know the thing where they say, um, all girls dream to be, uh, mm -hmm. of the other, mm -hmm. I, listen, when my big days are not wedding days, guys, you're going to the uh, park. I yes, thank you. No, my big thing is when I see it. No, like yeah. zero. Yeah, and I mean also yeah. when I zero. What are you wearing dinner? I keep on again. Yeah, love a boy. Do not keep that. And so I, I think a lot of people would probably be fascinated by that because I, I feel like a lot of people that come from families where they saw beautiful mm. love mm. and a love that is healthy, which is what mm. we assume when we see your family. Yeah. You assume that that's what you would want as well because you've seen it at home. Yeah, you want that kind of thing because it's warm. You know that beautiful love you see comes with, with its own cracks. Yeah, you know what I mean, and I'm not gonna say that my parents are, you know, 
I don't need maybe this way. Mm. It's just personal experiences. Mm. You know, I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say, you know, I've I've, I've never wanted to, you know, partner with someone. Mm-hmm. You know, um, and put this life thing together. Uh, I I tried. I have been mm-hmm. told many times I'm not wife material, and I'm okay with that. <laughs> what is that? That's so funny that, that I am so okay with that. I don't know whatever it is that you think wife is. I'm glad that I'm not that, you know, because it comes with, you know, um, you know, um, being fed rubbish about, you know, um, cultural, you know, I'm, I'm not against culture, mm. but I will not conform yeah. to things that just don't make sense. Also, oh, once you said white material, that means the certain things that I need yes. to be and do, like, to qualify, for like, life. how do I... In this day and age, look at survival skills and call them gender roles. I don't get it. Mm. Those are survival skills. You know, if I'm not home mm. and you're home, and I know what I'd be. Yes, you're gonna have to make some food. Mm. You know, and think of me. Mm. So I, I don't. I don't a lot of guys that we've met are oh, I don't know he gave me a bell pair. Mm-hmm. Like, for me, mm, ah, mm. guys, you can do better than that. It's a survival skill. You don't, once you home, and just because that has been done, really in um, some sort of entitlement, mm. you know, and also it breeds narcissism. Mm. You know what I mean? Where you don't even see yourself that you're becoming a narcissist, and now you just want all this marriage to be about you, you you know, and you being done right, you know, and when all is done right, you still get out and go drop panties, mm. you know, I, I, no, I didn't ever get my gun, like, is the biggest trick in the world, sure, I know, I know, you know, if I was, look, look I was born in the 70s, right, but right the tail of the 70s, mm. you know, so you'd expect me to go, just think like my mom and my grandmother, but I don't, you know. Um, I believe in that sense that are my ancestors' wildest dreams. I, I, I'm sure they've visited me in my dreams <laughs> and I've seen them wearing all these unattractive clothes. Uh, you know, what do you mean? I'm going to be a little bit No, I'm going to be our foremothers, yes. yes. you know, were tricked into this thing, and you know, some of them even married people that they didn't love, mm. only to mm. learn to love them. I don't know. In fact, a lot of them were told you will learn to love them because marriage was not about love. Yeah, it was always just an institution. For yeah, so growing a family. You need to do this thing together, and if I feel like I'm doing it alone, I feel like, yeah. And you rather be single. Oh, so, so, so you have a, a, an image of how a relationship's gonna go for you, how that goes for you. And how do you convince the next person that I mean, I'm so chat a lot of Well, look, you know, when you come to me as a guy, and um, you have interest in me as a guy, yeah. you know, um, probably you would have seen me sitting on some crate, mm. drinking my drink and chilling with my guys. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. You never confuse like, people. That's another thing I really like yeah, about you. Yeah. You know, is that what you are? Is yeah. what you are every single day. So the minute, <clears throat> pardon, the minute we get into this relationship, and now you want to change, <laughs> change me mm-hmm. into the woman that I'm not. I am not that girl. Mm-hmm. So if you feel like you you you're gonna, I, I I'm a nice challenge, my madam. Hey, are you kidding me? <laughs> <Hey. laughs> <Hey. laughs> Not tell you what happened. But but she's she's not a hey, yeah, hey, yeah, you know, I mean, like, either you like me for who I am or you don't. And I don't think there's any guy in this world that is ready for. I mean, there's few. Mm. We're just, you know, yeah, provinces are part of me, you know. Mm. But um, I don't think that there's a guy that um, can handle, you know, me. Not that I need to be handled, mm. but, you know, um, they're not ready for a woman like me. I like that you touched on not me that kind of girl because we people might ask what you mean, but we all know that kind of yeah. girl is a yeah. conventionally very yeah. attractive or very yeah. domesticated in a certain way. I'm domesticated, yeah. But it's a it's, it's a survival skill. Mm. You know? So that girl that you're talking about mm. is a girl that we also know that the industry has a trigger. Yes. How do you navigate that? Because 
the it's is built yeah. on the back of people that you know, are probably not like that girl. Yes, definitely. But that girl is the face of the yes. Um, and it's perfect. Yeah, uh, you know, if I'm not going to speak about Eve Sabbath, you know, then it's just the only character I've ever played mm-hmm. that I literally borrowed 90% of myself to. You know, I don't think that I've played the same element, you know, so people think that I'm mimicking her. <laughs> And they don't understand that actually it's me, mm. you know, I'm uh, borrowing a most mm. of me and I should have done that, but I have to, you know what I mean? Mm. So, um, if I didn't do it that way, I don't think I would have gone to the role, you know what I mean? Um, sure. So, I needed to literally fight with myself, you know, um, I tried to bring others on board. Just to convince me not to do it, mm-hmm. you know, and, and I knew that I, I just had to do it, you know. So, um, where you see Lucy, you see my like, I mm-hmm. said that she's not a criminal. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, mm-hmm. when I a criminal, she, she's not as bossy as she is or abusive as she is, you know. Um, uh, uh, but the way she speaks and the way she handles herself, um, that's more like me mm-hmm. than anything else, you know. So, this is all role you feel like it was more. Authentic to me, ah, yes, when you're acting, if you're acting, I'm just feeling it, you're not typically acting. Yeah, I just feel as though that there's a lot of me in it, you know, and some people may think that I'm, I'm, I may not be able to separate the two. And listen here, I did not study this, mm. so you know, just like those that studied, um, were never taught how to get out of character because mm. you're taught how to get in. But I know once I had a cat, I gave my knife. I am a long process. I am a long I am a long process. I am a long process. I am a long process. I am a long I am I I you know, eating means giving me an up. As a mummy's a my hire, ended up in jail. Eight years off her, and she came back into the world, had, you know, left her behind, and she swiftly caught up. Which is a yes, so I love you. Exactly. Did you have to kind of understand the life of someone that's actually prison and you know, you know, we live with such people. You know, so I don't think it's any different um, uh, from male to female. You know, so it's a lot of you for living and following mm-hmm. it. Uh, uh, particular, you know, um, routine, and that's that. So I don't have to really do research on this. I mean, even the HIV uh, um, the roles I played, the HIV positive roles I played, I didn't really need to do research. We had research on them, you know, with them, you know. So um, just to also bring normality to situations that are that may be outside of your space, you know. Yeah, actually, yeah. yeah. You, you've played a couple of roles, and I'm glad that you mentioned the other roles that you've played, but is there a role that you need to pick? Would you like, why am I really uneasy? Because I want to play. I know everyone wants to play. Everyone loves to play. So I don't, I don't think um, of playing the little more or whatever. I dream of, of playing real life characters. You know, they may not have, you know, um, uh, 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 me, you know, characters that exist in women, you know. Um, but I would love to play somebody who is physically and mentally challenged. Yeah, a lot of you rich. Yeah. You know, um, I mean, we tried, I love now, uh, we had to nip in the back because um, of the adventures, although they said yes. And I did ask. I did ask. I did yes. And then I scanned the contract and the next thing, like, oh, no, yeah, you can't do this too. So I did first season and second season, I think I worked out. Um, and, uh, yeah, that character was a bit, uh, was, you know, she was, uh... Is that why that character disappeared? Because that was a good character, you know, what he's like, yeah! <laughs> that character was... <laughs> Wait, isn't... Did that character stab someone with a spoon? Uh, did she? She stab somebody with something. Yeah! That character was scary. Uh, with a duke! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that character was so fit! <laughs> So I want to do worse than that, you know. Okay, actually, let's go into that character. So you were, you were obviously, 
play that role and you know, ask permission and you know that in the street. Mm-hmm. Kind of has to be like, yeah, did they throw the book? And they said yes. And I don't know if they didn't realize that, um, you know, she's asking for conflicts of interest. But also she's different from that. Yeah, right? very much so. It's just that um, both shows played at 8 o'clock. Yeah. You know, so, but one of them was just once a day, I mean, once a week, mm-hmm. you know, so, but um, nonetheless, um, uh, um, I just got to prove that these things can be done, just let us do them. You know what's sad about that is that I've seen a lot of males in that industry, yeah. you that know, yeah. and yeah. I've seen yeah. those challenges. I, I have a friend who recently, I have a friend who lost a job, mm. a big job. Huge job because she will be willing to ever be all set. Uh, and one of the guys on the show that was on the show, that show. on the very show that she was talking about, uh, these are two people on one show. Yes, one was let go and allowed to show the other show, and the other one. Yeah, see, those challenges that uh, males have a lot of fair threats in this industry. So, and you thought about starting your own thing. Many times. Um, I think you have the creative, the capacity, but also the self yeah. in terms of the people around you. Um, I just need to find the right people to work with. Yeah. You know, okay, like you are your little team. Yeah. Yeah. Now I need something like that. Yeah. So, because I will not, I, you know, I've told my colleagues that should I win the lottery or Apple or whatever, like I should have a lot of money. Mm-hmm. I still could to work. Who knows? You know, so I'm. Um, uh, I will not stop this because of wanting to pursue yeah. certain things and stuff, you know, so I'm... Um, but I do you know, think it gives yeah. you that satisfaction? You know, that is the way you are. Definitely, I will get there. I mean, I've only just taught many things that I'm looking for, so that's where it comes from. I was like, I uh, feel sure I must just write to produce my own freedom sources, but I end them in the middle of the kitchen, obviously. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, I don't think that it's a matter of, um, you know, you know, they're not wanting to work with me or whatever the case, you know, nah, nah, nah. If a job is not yours, it's not yours. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So I'm not that tired. When I say what I just said, um, I think it's, it's, it's more of an eye-opener that, listen, you know, um, maybe you should, you know, write your own, the story in your own. And I, I think what a lot of people do is that the amount of conditioning that goes on before she will be in charge starting there and until Train, but did I think because you wanted the job yeah. so much. But have you have you found yourself in a situation where you auditioned and you really felt like why not? Because we do it. Mm. Well you feel like how many auditions must I do? Yeah, I was so blessed when I did uh Chesa, right? Mm. Um I auditioned like everybody else. Mm. And somebody from Channel who was a machine avatar wanted a particular artist, mm-hmm. right? And that particular artist only came to the callback style. You know, you know where you pay off? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me add this too late, mm-hmm. you know? So, um, uh, because that particular somebody from Channel, you know, really wanted that particular artist mm-hmm. to be on the show, they were friends. And, um, I already be told that I got the job, mm-hmm. all right? Now I'm told I'm in real audition. I don't know who saw that tape of that audition because it wasn't me auditioning. It was me telling the channel exactly what to give up. You know, mm-hmm. like you can't do this. Mm-hmm. You aren't you calling us and using the rest of us. Mm-hmm. Only twenty ways, ways, yeah. You know, yeah, ahead of us, you know. So no waste of time. Some of us, I, I hear you could have been really talented. Mm. You know, you got to work with these shows. And um, <clears throat> so I think maybe in viewing the tape, they were not want that it's not an audition. Mm. And maybe they were not alone viewing the tape. And yeah, things were said. <laughs> Is it for <laughs> us? <laughs> things were said on that tape. And I was like, if it if I don't have a good I would have a fight. And the producers of the production company really wanted to work with me, mm. you know. I think that's another thing that people don't know. There's always, well not always, but you find that a lot of times in terms of productions, there's just really two kings in a four. Yeah. Two bulls were the kids. Exactly. One is the chance to say the one is the, yeah. And another the production said one this person. Exactly. So, um, if I did not fight that fight, um, uh, I would have probably questioned myself with it. Okay. 
you know, I, I like, you know, I feel ahead and... Uh. Also, the time that I've worked on walking away from something and thinking like, I need to just walk in front myself. Yeah, I mean, there's been auditions where, or don't worry, um, as you walk in, I mean, you've gotten the script, but not the character brief. Mm. And then as you get there, you ask about the character and they tell you, oh, no, this character is a, you know, a journalist and, you know, like, he's a, he's a vein, da 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 And I'm like, but my zoo is very township. Mm. So, can I... Um, Work out the audition and I'll leave some references and mm-hmm. you know, uh, um, ladies, I think, mm-hmm. in the of this world, you know. So, I've worked out of auditions like that, you know. Um, I refuse to play eyes and I refuse to play to be convinced, you know, to, to be like, Look, I can say this at home. It was just at home, it was a sitcom, and, <laughs> and I'm allowed to because you know, play around with it, yeah, the license to play yeah. around. And um, uh, I'm, I'm told that, you know, this character, I want to, you know, it, because who I know, I know how to talk, I can it on that city talk. Yes. Then I'll play that, you know, um, rubbish song. Yes. You know I mean? But I will not play a serious character who's a journalist and who is Tonga. She was going to be like me, me, and I'm going to try to convince people that I don't, I don't even know the Tonga. <laughs> know you know what's funny about this is I got called. Um, when I was still working in production behind the scenes, and I was called because I can help with like, yeah, translate, yeah, yeah. but I'm like, I'm from so wet, so I can translate out there, and I need to see what they say. And then I was asking how to do it and read that. I was like, well, this is taking chances because I'm yeah, not going to get the rap, you know? <laughs> But there's people, because you know, there's people that believe, just do it anyway. Yeah, just do it anyway, you know, for the dawn. For the non-da. I'd rather be penniless than to try to convince people while trying to prevent them. I cannot do it. I'm not a fan. I don't know why this is getting me so much. <laughs> because let me tell you, there's artists that do that. They'll take the freaking dog. They'll take the dog, but the next thing wants it to. You're like, question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. How did we get there? <laughs> so I guess hunger. Yeah. At the same time, we need to be disciplined. Yeah. Hunger. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? It's like going for an interview or lying on your CV. Then it's sad now. It's game day. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you said you know yourself. Hey. Hey. Yeah. That's how you're going to remember your own life. <laughs> no, I will never play doctor right now. <laughs> really? No, no. If you do doctor and lawyer, I'd rather go and try out the lawyer. Right. Why? Because at least... You know, the jargon, you know, um, uh, uh, I can I can somehow kind of like, you know, relate to it yeah. in a way. But the jargon never talked to Harry. I'm sorry, there's actors out there. I don't know how to jargonize the jargon. Yeah. I'm just not one. I'm not. Like, we are not You know, no one's like, I'm going to be a local radio maternity station. I always try myself. You know, you get a solution. <laughs> no. <laughs> that is actually so funny because when you say it like that, right? Yeah. There were a lot of artists and Hollywood evolved, including brother. Mm. If everyone was honest about that. <laughs> What would be in a better, you know, entertainment environment, so, like, honestly. Oh, man, you yes. have really killed me. <laughs> nah, it's just one of those, man. I just refuse to do so, certain things, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I learned to go to yourself. Why are you going to do this again? I don't know. Also, something else you said about... Uh, the confidence that, or rather lack of, mm. that comes to you from the Lord. If I saw it or the East, mm. you're not confident in one language to pull it off to the point where you say, and this is also a bit of a doctor. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I'm yes. a yes. Yes. But I'm not. No, I can't do the comedy drama. Do you know what I mean? No, I can't. My name was on. You know what I mean? And so, you said that you're not to funny. Yes, yes. I'd leave it to the likes of funny, mm. you know, and then. But out of the blue, J, because if I do, yeah. Oh, no, man, guys, I'm going to try something else. Yeah, I'm, I'm a firm believer of, uh, uh, okay, I've been sent to the wrong audition. I believe that the right one is 
still to come. I will go and grace them. Mm. But I will be honest and say, guys, I'm not that good in this language. Mm. So you'd have to get a language advisor and what I don't know. You know. Um, get a language that at least you can try and speak. Mm. But one that you have... Yay! <laughs> You take chances. Uh, do you want to tell them to think, well, no, no, I'll get there. I'd be like, ah, I'm not a mood. I'm not a mood. It's like, imagine using Oswani's um, Zulu. You know, yeah. For China. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think she allows Yeah. But you know what I'm finding, right? Is that productions are. I think it's starting to really take themselves seriously. Mm. Because when we talk about now, I remember seeing it a lot growing up. Yeah, yeah. it's like, yeah, there is. Or, or uh, too much of a mix, like the one with Swana, but the child speaks thing. Yeah, and then, but yeah. I feel like the yeah. production will come so far yeah. now that it makes sense. I don't want Shelly to get a thing. Mm. 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 No. Do you know what I mean? No, no, no. And it's okay to have all those real actors in the country and that. In the show. It's a story to tell. Exactly. It's also their story to exactly. tell. Exactly. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, you know, kudos and we're very proud of you guys. Yeah. And yeah, they did a, an awesome job. An awesome job. Uh, outside of acting and uh, yeah, an incredible mom, and you did mention that there's things that you really want to do, uh, where, where is brand Manaka here to? Um, I see that they tried to do me to an influencer. Yeah, you have to see. The social media has ruined us. I know I need influencer. Yeah, I'll go try other pl- in, in other spaces, guys. You, you know. have to. Yeah, we'll go for it. Like, okay, fine. But align me with brands that are, mm. you know, mm. don't go and align me with Nestle and try and make me um, a good say, say, mom when I'm a <laughs> good mom. Yeah, you know, you make the formula. Yeah, one little guy in an island in my house. Um, okay. You know, I was going to have to go and buy my own product. Okay. Yet. But brand association for you. Associate me proper. Mm-hmm. You know, don't, don't don't come for me and think that, you know, I'm going to give you, you know, yappy mom. I'm not a yappy mom. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, I really am not. You yeah. know, so, um, yeah, I, if, if, like, say, for example, you know, um, brand association, you know, uh, uh, if Nestle really wants to work with me, you know, I'm just mentioning these brands because they're mentionable. Nestle is really dope, though. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Allow me to, to show what those are Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, those those the realistic models yeah, that you yeah, see that you yeah, with. The ones, actually that are buying the actual product more mm. than the yappy mom. So I have a yappy mom, chances are different like reality. But I would say yappy mom and that's why it's a brand association. So, um, like, I don't know what to do with that. I think that the conversation is brand, uh, maybe it's Ilgra looking the same in how they, they yes, everybody, everybody brands is, and all. Everybody is gray and everybody is like, you know, um, <laughs> in, on <laughs> islands, you know. <laughs> And it just did not work out. I did not, they did, they, it didn't work out. I could not get what they wanted because what they wanted felt like something that is not me. Mm-hmm. So when they pulled the strings, asked my team, I had already pulled the strings. I was like, I guess, hard for it. I need what I like. And they kept on sending me pictures and videos of examples of yappy moms. Sorry, guys, I just... Also, if you're going to come to me, then you know that I'm not going to give you that. So no. let's work around what I know no. I can give like, you. Like, have you seen that reality show that I'm on? Mm. Like, I've got no makeup, like, right now. You know what I mean? I'm not trying. Um, and I'm not, I'm not saying I'm not putting uh, an effort, but yeah. effort for what? Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think it's an effort thing, right? I think there's an authenticity that we all have inside of us. Yeah. And for some people, it's more on the surface. Yeah. Us. Yeah, yes. You know, and I'm not like that. Yeah. So, you know, what you see is what you get. And it won't be no different. You know, and if you want me in makeup, then give me the money that will give me a proper crew. Yeah. Because I feel as though this influencer thing, you know, um, it's also, you know, number one, trying our time. Number two, <laughs> they're not giving us what they give me production because we we are cutting the cost yeah for them we are the cut the cost you know what i mean so naturally they would have to go and hire production company yeah. but it's a proper commercial yeah you know what i mean 
And now they say that, no, we don't want it commercial looking like, but the examples they sent you are mm -hmm. commercial looking mm -hmm. like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So clearly they want the commercial, mm -hmm. right? But they don't want to pay you what commercial is. What commercial yeah, is. Gonna and as an influencer. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, give me that 150K that you gave yeah. that production company so I can give you a proper, yeah. you know what I'm trying to say? Don't come and cut corners. That's why I get another influencer, guys. No, I give it to them, right? Uh, even your best job, I think a good brand, a relevant brand, but a brand that also understands your brand, yes. um, collaborating with you would actually be fire. Because yes. I think what what, what people need, because whether we like it or not, the world of influencers and digital world mm. will exist for a long time. For a long time. It's know? just associating yeah. with brands that understand your brand. Exactly. That we are meeting somewhere to create something. And exactly. What that means to exactly. You know. Um. So yeah, man. Yeah, I. Nike. <laughs> Don't know this one, eh? Mm -mm. Let's 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 um in the future for for when I for Lucy for every eight thing that you've been doing. Uh well we're still doing Lucy. It's eight years now doing Can Lucy. You it? Yeah, and uh, my parents were shocked the other day when I told them. Um so it's almost ten years now. So um I think now I need to get serious about my foundation. Mm -hmm. You know, because I really do want to help um, you know, certain people in the country and also um, get serious with production. You know, it's not like I'd be sitting and not trying, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, and for me, uh, the failures or the lack of, you know, team mm -hmm. um, are not going to stop me. So I'll continue trying. And one day you will see something. Let you know, me tell you something. By these. Let me tell you something that, <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> I've appreciated about digital mm. is starting mm. influence like this. I yes. I started a production company a while ago. Mm. I have pitched until I was blue in the face. Mm. Shows that I do believe would be amazing, mm. and I'm sure some of them are out there. Some it's of them you'll some of them you'll see them with a trust yeah. down and you're like, oh, I've never talked yeah. to you about this, right? Yes. But yes. I can tell you one thing: start where you are. Start with what are these guys? Mm. Shoot a web series. Mm. Shoot. When you're on the street with your people, I believe that when you start, you almost push into gear your angels, the universe, God, yeah, the and everyone to meet you. So I'm gonna say, I've started. Yeah, it's not small with the web series, it's not on YouTube. Yeah, it's free. free. I'll, I'll reach you on YouTube. Agents, you guys are shooting no man. <laughs> <laughs> No, don't worry. I'll I mean, you can get... borrow you guys, but please. I'll get there. You, you know, know what I mean? I'll get there. You know, I, I, I also believe in timing, you know, mm. perfect timing, you know mm. what I mean? So um, when it happens, you know, then I uh, both know that this is the time, you know what I mean? So, mm. yeah, it's not like, you know, it's... No. So, yeah, one day is one day. I can't wait for that day when I think you brilliant. I think you... I think you're funny, but I think there's so much more that you can offer this mm, industry. Thank you. Um, and I think there's so much more you've given this industry. Mm. And it's a thankless job, so, you know. No, definitely, you know what I mean? And don't think we're gonna be asking for pictures. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's non thank you for me. <laughs> One you, <user. laughs> Yeah, it's a thankless job, it's a thankless yeah. industry, but it really is a passion project for it a lot is. of us. So it is, uh, to be able to live and do what you do every yeah. day and it's something that you love, I think this is yeah. in its summer. Right. Yeah. yeah, definitely. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me, guys. And um, if you could speak to any old man, I call you see it. Sir. I would literally say, high five. Yeah. I, you did that. Yeah, you've done really well. You know, um, maybe 10 year old are not where you are. Um, yeah, we've lost a few and I cannot complain. I don't like telling myself, I, I should have, I should have, I could have. No, mm -hmm. for me that just like non-existent, mm -hmm. you know, because once you do, you do. And it's there, you know, there's no undoing. You know, if I can't unsay or unsmell or unsee, mm -hmm. you know, so I, I don't play the, the regret game, so. Um, yeah, man, if I were to come back and do it again, yes, there's things that I've improved at, but not in this lifetime. What's done is done. Mm. Yeah. So it's just about moving forward, you know, mm. and seeing if you can improve there. But in this lifetime, guys, no, don't beat yourself up. 
Mama lang mo. Kwa siya na mo siya. Eh? Pero sabi mo. Eh, pili pa bita ay milyon. Kwa siya. Na 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 ete ete. Eh, wey na. You know, we've got bigger problems than just um beating ourselves up. We are too hard on ourselves. Um, I mm. I always tell my siblings, you know, that listen, one step at a time, mm. one step at a time, and always remember the God that you are not reminded of. You know, mm. you know, you know, you know the God that was there when you were learning how to mm. how to crawl. Mm. That God that made you crawl. Mm. Remember that God. She doesn't have to ask anything. Yeah, it's just still there. there. Yes, mm. still there, still there. So sure. whatever it is you go through in life. <laughs> Because if you don't, then you're you're believing in what other people believe in, and you've lost your own belief system. That's your problem. Like that. So when did that? Uh, when the angel of death comes, can he please take that request? Because I wouldn't want my dad to exist in a world where he's got no wife. I know my mom will survive. I know she will, but. Um, when that happens, God with it, when it is going to happen anyway, so we can't, you know, um, forget it. Um, yeah, that, 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 that man, uh, is not perfect. Mm-hmm. No, nah? uh, but she was there. Mm-hmm. He was there. Like, he was extremely present. The only thing that took him from us was work. And that was that. My mom was so blessed that she's never... They've had their own fights, but never mm. a single fight was about an- another woman mm. or another man. So they feel so good to each other. You Just know, they're love. human. Yeah, they're human. They've got their own fallouts and 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 um, and they come from a great. I mean, guys, I imagine my father. Guys, the parents, you know, now would have long wanted to die. Mama, we don't feel about it. Fasting. Over the nineteen twenty. Yeah. Over the nineteen twenty. Yes. Nineteen sixty. 70, 80, 90. No, the woman thought there's no freedom coming. My mother gave what about freedom? And you know how patriarchal, you know, our culture and religion is. So now having to exist in a world where that doesn't. That's challenged now. Yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? Mm-hmm. You know, you know, in, I, I don't think I would have survived like my dad. Mm. You know, I mean, I'm never looking at it that way. Yeah, it's a yeah, but I mean, like you know, I'm thank God for you know, um, uh, uh, gracing us with more years than Papa. Mm. You know, um, but yeah, man, the those two shame, they they really tried. They did the best they could. You think you you hear more for him because you imagined he's really just had you more. So I mean, it's like. The person that's holding him together. Well, I'd be the one to have to look after. I'm in the Bahada, so we could take turns. Yeah, I know. But um, I really feel like for any man that was born beyond the forties, mm. um, uh, it's it's a uh, it's, it's, it's it's a very big challenge, you know, mm. um, to force them to let go of certain habits. Mm. You know, and um, they think we leave our rights, mm-hmm. you know, and now it just turns out that no, actually, no, they, no, they're not right. It's just yeah. rubbish. You they know? never them to die. Yeah. yeah, you know, so um, now I'm having to exist in this world that we exist in, the generation Z. But we can say, no, my truth, that was okay. In case, in case, but anyway, it is what it is. Thank you so much. Yeah, we get it all. I think. He did with like your comms, siblings and that all the time. It's not because you're a weird family or anything. Families have yeah. and they would be so when you leave to the other side. No, definitely will do. Be I know be well. Oh yeah. you have to. Also we've watched you guys go through all of those things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know you'll never get to the other side. Manakaranaka. Hey everybody, thank you so much. Thanks so much for watching. Um yeah, thank you so much for liking, commenting, sharing, whatever it is that you do do the same with this video. Tell your friends, tell your friends. Moments of Muncie was here. Uh, and we have our winner. We have our winner. We have our winner for that trip. It's going to be happening soon. So that's the video. Now that is the rampage, Moments of Muncie. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>